Katie Coonsy. I'm the horticulture agent at the Bullitt County Extension Service. And this is one of our plant beds for our Master Gardener spring plant sale for next year. And so we're out here weeding today and I just wanted to show you a couple of the weeds that have come up and kind of talk about what they are. So if you want to come with me. All right, so these little guys over here, uh, they look like clover. I'm gonna pick one and show it to you. It's very common in yards and flower beds. It's called yellow wood sorrel. Um, it is an edible if you're into that and you, you know it's not had any chemicals used on it, you can eat it. Uh, but it has these really explosive seed pods on it. I don't know if you can see that. They get a lot bigger than that. That's a small one. It's pretty early in the season. So get them early because if these pods develop, as you brush against the plant, they explode and they have these little attachments on their seed coat where they can just cling to your clothing and your shoes and then you carry them all over the yard. Or when they explode, they pop up probably 10 to 20 feet. So they spread pretty easily. So you'll get these guys everywhere. Uh, another one I wanted to talk about was lamb's quarters. It is also an edible. Uh, lamb's quarters, when it's small, is very palatable and it has kind of a silvery sheen to it. I don't know if you can see it in the inner leaves there it has a little silvery sheen to it uh, but it'll get it'll get about two or three feet tall if you let it go you really don't want to let this guy go so go ahead and pull them and try to get the whole root when you're weeding by hand it's really important to get the whole root because if you don't it's very likely that that plant's going to come back and bother you again Another one that we can talk about is, of course, dandelions. So this is a very small dandelion. You want to get them when they're very young. Now you see this little taproot? You see it's almost about the same size as the plant is on top. Well, as this plant gets bigger, so does that taproot. And when you pull it, if you miss any part of that taproot, that sucker's coming back. Um, it gets about as long as a carrot. So it's really important to get these guys early. Uh, if you're using chemical treatment, the sooner you treat, the better, because the small guys has a very small root system, but as they get larger, that, that big tap root's really hard to kill out. So if you're using herbicide treatments, a lot of time it will only kill the top of the plant, and then the plant comes right back from the root system.